probably preface this with the fact that Greg LaCasse commissioned this song. Uh, he asked if this be written. Uh, hey, it can is. I ask a question? Can I make one comment? It's, it's sung with love. Just one thing. Yeah. All of the TARDIS, you're way more than generally acceptable. You've been like family to me. <laughs> Chris TARDIS? Greg, shut up, will you? <laughs> Sorry about that, Dad. But, yeah. The song came because uh, Greg, Greg gave me a title, and that was all, that was all he gave me to work with. Uh, you're here. And that title is... Chris, Ar Chris Tardif sucks, but all of the Tardifs <laughs> are generally acceptable. <laughs> <laughs> he's loud, he's tall, someone take his keys before he kills us all. He's goofy. Insane. He'll call you a wuss while you're writhing in pain. He might be gay. All of those signs are beginning to become perceptible. Chris taught it sucks, but all of the taught it is generally acceptable. <laughs> <laughs> Second rate soda, he's your man. And every time he ducks, and he has to stand. Play hoops looks funny. He's kinda like Luke Walton, but without the money. He works in sales, it's like prostitution, but a little less respectable. Cut it up. All of the TARDIS is generally acceptable. <laughs> Fuck you, TARDIS. It's generally acceptable. It's a new TARDIS. Oh, well, she's generally acceptable. Do we, TARDIS? It is generally acceptable in Joe Tardif. Well, he's generally acceptable, the other Joe Tardif. It's generally acceptable, but Chris Tardif. Everybody, stop. We never see him. He's unstable in the city every week until he drops anchor in Haverhill, puts his bros before his hose. Unless those hoes are from Chicago. He's a happy then we're all gonna be acceptable. His Tardis sucks, but all of the Tardis are generally acceptable. Chris Tardif sucks. Chris Tardif sucks. Chris Tardif sucks. And so do you, Chuck. <laughs>